Welcome back to Let's Play Ratchet and Clank Tools of Destruction. I'll make sure it's short than that in the next part. I'll just say Tools of Destruction. I mean, hopefully you know this is Ratchet. Come on. Look at those ears. And this is the first time you get to use six axis. Pretty, uh, unique area. Looks pretty quiet. Where's Quark? Greetings, citizen. I'm away from my post at the Planetary Defense Center. Please enter the number that best describes your emergency. If you are being attacked by a radioactive amoeboid, please press 1. If you have been ingested by a mutant space eel, please press 2. If your city is being attacked by a massive deadly space armada, please press 3. I believe you may be their intended target. You think? My intended target is toast. I want toast. I don't care about lombaxes. You have to be fired from those guys' army. I mean, how do they eat toast? Uh, Sensors are picking up structural damage to the grind rail. I won't ponder that question. <laughs> they don't have any arms to eat it with, any anyway. I guess you could use their robot. Ratchet, that warship is gaining on us. And that's the end of this level. Another cutscene. species, ruler of the universe! Your name's Percival? <laughs> Emperor! See the crown? See the scepter? The giant walking throne and legion of royal robotic commandos? Emperor! Not that a treacherous furball like you could... What's this? <laughs> Such a primitive robot companion. And your kind used to be such renowned engineers. <laughs> oh, I'd be careful if I were you. He's got posomorphic plaster paint at the new fingertip. <clears throat> My gripe is not with the people of this arcade planet, but with you. Surrender your death bot. And simply allow us to kill you. No one else need be harmed. Fair enough. Here you go. <clears throat> Yeah, Emperor Tachyon. Pretty, uh, shrimpy for, uh, Emperor. Autopilot engaged. Whoa! Hang on, Clank! Hyperspace boosters online. Engaging cryosleep. Cryosleep? I don't know. There's no way I'm gonna... It is fortunate cryosleep does not work on robots. <laughs>
Clank! Clank! Are you okay? Ash has a furry face. I got knocked out there for a minute. I am. Uh huh. Fine. Where are we? Beats me. Good old PS3 graphics. Run out of fuel while on autopilot. Oh. Come on. Okay, I think Ratchet just has bad luck. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's why it keeps on crashing ships. Oops, wrong weapon. Change, quick select, pause. That way I can keep on moving if I do this. Big fella. Well, scary, huh? You think you're scary, huh? I'm not scared of you. And now we upgraded the combustor, so both weapons are level 2. And if you upgrade your weapon, I've, any, um, any upgrade does not give you any uh, more ammo, it just gives you damage increase. Uh, that probably does not include the... Of course it doesn't include the uh, version 5 of the weapon. You get an upgrade for the version 5, it adds a little extra functionality to the weapon. You have acquired Raritanium. This valuable resource can be used to upgrade your weapons. Simply go to a weapons vendor and select the Upgrade Weapons option. And strangely enough, we were just talking about upgrading our weapons. And there's how you do it. Yep. And uh, just because this is 100% Gato, also show where all the... Uh, rare titanium chests are. I think uh, for this weapon, uh, version five, it sets the ground on fire. So this weapon, uh, yeah, any any of the enemies that walk through the areas on fire get damaged by it.
We'll all jump up here. Get these crates. Breaky, breaky. I love breaking things. And blowing things up. But I like blowing things up even more. I I prefer I I prefer to take out the smaller enemies with combustor and fusion grenade. Use those to take out the uh, caterpillar-like enemies or millipedes. I don't know their exact name. I don't know much of the enemies' names. As long as you have ammo to do that. Another wall jump slot. These are multiplier crates which allow you to multiply both bolts and raritanium. With the jackpot power up, you will temporarily earn more bolts and raritanium. Okay. I'll use the fusion grenade to blow these up so I can break them easy. Just like uh, UIA, you actually get the you actually get introduced to the multiplier crate early on, uh, the first official level. Okay, here you probably want to use fusion grenades because they do the most damage at the moment. And then these ammo dispensers, they will respawn after a few minutes, I think. Or a few seconds, not a few minutes. About 30 seconds. Allow you to get more ammo and then you can finish the boss. And he's down. Pretty easy. You have collected a Leviathan soul. These are valuable in the Polaris galaxy and can be traded for bolts. Yep. Yeah, there's no area in the game like in the past two games. Um, UIA and Going Commando. Going Commando actually had two of these areas uh, where you can collect uh, crystals and stuff, sewer crystals, uh, whatever they're called in Going Commando, uh, desert something, crystals, or crystals too. But those are basically a replacement of lions and souls for those. This game. Attention, citizens of Kabalia. The Imperial Defense Force reports that a Lumbax has infiltrated the Star Sector. The Empire expects your full cooperation in neutralizing this threat to our security. Welcome to Grummelnet's Weapon Shop. Here you can buy ammo, upgrade your weapon, or purchase new tools of destruction. Go ahead, name your poison. And see you for this part. See ya.